You know, you ought to have seen them. You might even have told some people that you have seen them to impress them when actually you haven't seen them. Well, here are seven box set classics that you really ought to watch. And we're going to do it all in under five minutes. So let's go. John Hamm plays the enigmatic Don Draper in this series that follows the fortunes of the Sterling Cooper ad agency in 1960s New York. He also smokes a lot of cigarettes and drinks a lot of whiskey, if that's your thing. So, uh, what do you fellas do? You're looking at the finest ad men in New York. Hell, <laughs> the world. Famed for its brilliant storytelling and visual identity that takes you back to the 1960s in an age that has gone forever, this remains one of the critics' favourites for a reason. It's truly brilliant. What do you think goes on when a mob boss goes to therapy? Well, you only need to watch The Sopranos to find out. When you think of the shit we've been through, huh? Shit we've done. Exploring the complex mind and world of Tony Soprano, played by the brilliant late great James Gandolfini, The Sopranos is a tour de force in drama television. The Sopranos is a masterpiece and a show that changed the way that TV is made, becoming one of the first true box set classics. It also has an ending that will get you thinking. When a high school chemistry teacher is diagnosed with terminal cancer, what do you think he does? Well, of course, he starts cooking crystal meth with a former student and becomes a drug kingpin. Who wouldn't, eh? Run, Mr. White, run! Get a little excitement in your life. <laughs> Beautifully paced, brilliantly written, and fantastically acted, this is a show that has everything and rightfully is one of the great dramas of all time. So it's one that you have to watch before you, well, before you switch off your TV. The only two things in life that are certain are death and taxes, and I'm sure they paid their taxes in this show, but there's definitely a lot of death. <laughs> I think it's really cool you live in a funeral home. It's totally weird. Casket climber. I think your father is having some sort of midlife crisis. Based around the Happy Fisher family who run a funeral home in Los Angeles, this is a dark, twisted, and very, very compelling drama. Listen, how dare you put Lost on this list because I understand the ending is unsatisfactory even though I haven't actually seen it. Well, I say to you, the journey's good and also everything's not perfect in life. Do you really think all this is an accident? That we, a group of strangers, survived? Do you think we crashed on this place by coincidence? Each one of us was brought here for a reason. And who brought us here, John? The island. Listen, you don't always get all the answers in life, and you might not get all the answers in Lost, but that doesn't mean it's not worth watching. Especially if you're sitting in a grey room with the rain coming down outside, and you just think, oh, that'd be a nice island to go on holiday to. Bit of a weird holiday, but nice island. Want to be uplifted by a brilliant president saying great things and surrounded by people who are smarter than you will ever, ever meet? Well, you want to watch the West Wing. With the clothes on their back, they came through a storm. And the ones that didn't die want a better life than they want it here. Talk about impressive. My point is this. Break's over. You will be inspired, you will be enthused, and you will be entertained by Aaron Sorkin's fantastic dialogue and brilliant characters in The West Wing. A masterpiece of TV drama. A gritty exploration of crime and policing in Baltimore and Maryland, The Wire quite rightly has its place as one of the great box sets of all time. It ain't about right, it's about money. Like you guys never stole nothing back in the day. We ain't back in the day. Go, go, go! You follow the drugs, you get a drug case. You start following the money, you don't know where you're going. Senator Davis. Y'all making friends in a lot of places, right? That's the best work I ever did. Starring Idris Elba and Dominic West, to name but a few, this is a series that will keep you gripped to the very end. Okay, so that's it. That's seven box set classics, and we've managed to do it in under five minutes. Go and watch them all if you haven't seen them. All that remains to say is if you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to the channel. Leave in the comments below what are your favourite box sets of all time. We'll see you again very soon.